हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड मॉर्निंग आई होप यू ऑल आर सेफ एंड हेल्दी एट योर होम वेलकम इन लेक्चर नंबर 19 पेपर नंबर आई सी टेन यूनिट नंबर थ्री इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी डिस्कस अबाउट ओशन थर्मल एनर्जी एज ए पार्ट ऑफ ओशन थर्मल एनर्जी According to our syllabus, we have one topic that is energy from tides. So, in this lecture, we will discuss about energy from tides. Let us discuss. Tide is a periodic rise and fall of water level of sea. which are carried out by the action of sun and moon on the water of earth surface some of experiments and detail of sea's gravitational force sea and moon's gravitational force we have tides in our oceanic water so tide is a periodic rise and fall of water level of sea second point the large scale up and down movement of sea water represents an unlimited source of energy it is very important point and why we get energy from tides the large scale up and down movement of sea water according to sun and moon's gravitational force large scale sea water is up and down and so this up and down has kinetic energy and this type of kinetic energy we use and we generate electric power so it is very important and large scale renewable sources the main features of the tidal cycle is the difference in water surface elevation at high tides and at a low tides we also this type of mechanism known at our sea shore in high tides the water level is near about some places while in low tide the water level go far so this is the main features in tidal cycle the difference in water surface elevation at high tide and at the low tide the main tidal ranges on western coasts it is noted that in western coasts and in eastern coasts and especially in kerala varies from 3 to 10 meters it is very important point the main tidal range in western coasts eastern coasts and in kerala varies from 3 to 10 meters the differential head utilized for the running of the turbines the tidal energy can be converted into electrical energy by means of attach generator to high tide and to low tides are produced during a lunar month the component of tidal power plant there are three main components of tidal power plant number 1 the power house number 2 dam or barrage to form pool or basin and number 3 sluice way these are the main component the power house dam to form basin and sluice way these are the main three component for the tidal power plant the turbines 
electric generators and other auxiliary equipments are the main equipments of powerhouse. The powerhouse requires turbine, electric generator and other auxiliary equipments. And the function of dam to form a barrier between sea and the basin. Dam, dam is the main part and its function is to form a barrier between the sea and the basins. Now we discuss the principle of tidal power generation. Here I show two different types of figures. One is in high tide and second in low tide. So the sluice way are used either to fill the basin during the high tide or empty the basin during the low tide as per operational requirement. There are gate control valves. These are in figure. This is the sluice way which is used for the fill up or empty the basin and the slice way contains get valve get valve this is the turbine this is the turbine and contains get valve so we control the flow of filling or emptying the basin at high tide or in low tide. The design cycle may be also provided for pumping between the basin and the sea in either direction. If reversible pump turbines are provided, if in the turbines there are reversible pumps. There are reversible turbines are provided. The pumping operation can be taken over at any type by the same machine. We use if the reversible pump turbine are provided in this type of mechanism then in fill up of basin we convert kinetic energy into electrical energy and in emptying the basin we also use the kinetic energy which converted into electric energy now the next point operation method of utilization of tidal energy the power generation from tides involves flow between an artificially developed basin and the sea. For this type of operation, we have prepared artificially developed basin, artificially basin or a pool which store the sea water in high tide and we emptying in low tide. There are two different arrangements. Number one, single basin arrangement and number two, double basin arrangement. Double bass is not here basin. Double basin arrangement. So, we have two different type of arrangements for the utilization of tidal energy that is single basin arrangement and double basin arrangement. We discuss both. In this lecture, we will discuss only single basin arrangement and in lecture, lecture, lecture number 20, we discuss about double basin arrangement. So, first of all, we discuss about single basin arrangement. Here, Describe diagram is single basin type tidal energy power plant. In a single basin arrangement, 
there is only one basin interacting with C. In this figure, this is the basin which is filled up with the help of sea water. So, in single basin arrangement, only one basin, only one basin which interacting with the sea water. The two are separated by a dam. The basin and sea is separated by the dam. Here is the dam. This is the dam. In figure, this is the dam. I derive it in this round. This is the dam. So, basin and sea water, they too are separated by a dam. And the flow between them is through slice way. Here one way is also and here also is one way. So the slice way located conveniently along the dam. In this figure we arrange two slice ways. This is also a diagram for the single basin tidal energy conversion plant. The dam embodies a number of slice clades and low head turbine set. In this figure, we describe here as turbine and here as turbine. When the high tide comes, the slice gates are open. When high tide comes, the slice gate open to permit sea water to enter the basin. When high tide comes, the slice gates are open and sea water enter to basin while the turbine set are shut. At the beginning of the low tide, when beginning of low tide, the slice gates are closed and water from the basin flow over the turbine. When the low tide beginning, the slice gates are closed. So, water is not flow in sea from reservoir or basin. Now, we flow water from turbines into lower level sea water. So, the sufficient difference between the kinetic energy in sea water. So, sufficient difference between the full reservoir level and failing tide level runs the turbine. This type of mechanism is takes place in single basin type tidal power plant and in high tide we store sea water in basin and at a position of low tide this storage water is fell down on turbine turbine is joined with generator so kinetic energy of water is converted into mechanical energy in turbine and this turbine is joined with generator which produce electricity. This type of mechanism and arrangement we get energy from tides. This is also the same diagram for the single basin type of arrangement. In this type of diagram, we show exactly the position of dam, basin and sea and also the hydraulic turbine generator, turbine and generator's position. This is the figure of high tide when 
basin is filled up in high tide sea water and this is the figure where low tide is beginning then the slice way is closed and open the turbine way where water fall down on hydraulic turbine generator which produce the electricity sometimes in this type of systems in single basin arrangement in high tide or in low tide the htz high turbine generator contains reversible pumping so reversible process when in high tide we fill up basin then the turbine is converted its mechanical energy into energy and when beginning of low tide the reversible pump starts so it also produce mechanical energy into electrical energy so in some cases there are reversible pumps are provide for production of electric energy in filling of basin or in emptying of basin this is also a layout of single basin type tidal power plant i have some videos for this type of tidal power plant which are attached here so please see the videos in high tide fill up the basin and slice way gets turbine so which converts mechan so mechanical energy is converted into electrical energy and we get electric power with the help of moon and sun there are tide in sea so when high tide rig arise we fill up the reservoir and in low tide it is emptying using turbine which get generate electricity in india different position of this type of tidal power plant in our gujarat in kutch this type of plant this is also a tidal power plant in high tide and we and low tide difference between both tide we get kinetic energy of tides and it converts into electric power this type of mechanism is also provided in some cases position of generator in low tide 
एंड इन हाई टाइड थैंक यू